Hey everyone, I'm going to show you how you can use Dixper with unsupported games that do not use DirectX. Balkan based games, for example. First, we will download the Dixper host window from GitHub. I'll put the link in the description. We're going to go on to GitHub here and we're going to select this Dixper host window version 1.0.0.zip. The version may be different by the time you get this link. Once that's downloaded, we'll extract that on our desktop. Now that we have this extracted and the, the window open, we can run the Dixper host window application. After this closes, you won't see anything running as it'll be a completely transparent window, but you will see it running in your taskbar. Mine's on the top right here. Now that the Dixper host window is running, we can open up Dixper Studio. For our game, instead of choosing your normal game, which will never sync up if it's Vulkan based, we will choose the Dixper host window. Now that we have Dixper Studio synced up to our host window, we can move over to OBS or slobs in this example. We will add a game capture to our scene so we can capture what we'll be seeing on the screen. So we're going to go into slobs here and we're going to add a new game capture. We're going to call it Dixper host window. We're going to add source. We're going to capture a specific window and we're going to make sure it is the Dixper host window that we capture. We're also going to make sure that we allow transparency. We're going to click done. Now, after we've done this in a normal scenario, we would also add a game capture for our regular game that is not supported by Dixper. And we would go through the same process and just capture that and make sure that the Dixper host window is on top of it so your stream sees what you're seeing. But since I won't actually be using Streamlabs OBS, I just have my desktop captured, in which case, if you're capturing your desktop, you don't need to capture anything else because it's already going to be captured. You'll see that it shows up on my screen, but I have full control over everything that is underneath here and move things around because this host window sits on top of everything else, but you can still click through it into your game, onto your desktop, all of that. So there you have it. Using Dixper on unsupported games, Get the visuals for the skills that normally wouldn't work with Vulcan based games or use it for other types of streams like just chatting or really any type of stream. And don't forget to subscribe, like the video and come use some Dixper skills on me at twitch.tv slash Darth